We're going to be palpating a muscle on the side of the nose and into the upper lip, known as levator labi superioris aliqui nasi. So this muscle has two parts to it. I'm just going to be palpating up on the maxilla here near the frontal bone. So our muscle is originating up here in the corner of the eye and it comes down in our first part, the nasal part. It's going to be inserting into the alar cartilage. So again, origin and down to the nasal cartilage. And the second part of it is going down into the upper lip. So the name of the muscle in levator labi, levator meaning elevate and labi being lip. So it elevates it and its third part is superiorly. So it's going to raise the upper lip superiorly. And then the second part of its name is aliqui nasi, which is referring into the alar cartilage. So it's going to flare the nostril as well as elevate the upper lip. So are you able to do that action for us? Excellent. So you can see nice contraction and shortening of the muscle on that side as well as the lip is being raised and her nostril is flaring. So if you want to just rest your finger along the side and you can feel the contraction of this muscle all the way down into the musculature of the upper lip. This muscle is innervated by the facial nerve. All right, we're going to be palpating another muscle on the face that's just lateral to the levator labi superioris aliqui nasi. So that muscle was running right here. This muscle has a very similar actions and its name is levator labi superioris. So instead of without the nasal part of it, it's originating just lateral. So our first kind of muscle was up here on this frontal process of the maxilla. And now what I'm going to be looking for is just below her orbital margin, there's actually a foramen, the infraorbital foramen. So you're going to use that to help kind of landmark where this muscle is originating. So people will say it's either on the infraorbital margin or kind of just medial to that foramen. And then it's going to be running down and inserting into the musculature of the upper lip. So again, levator labi superioris, meaning it's elevating the musculature of the upper lip. So she's able to do that action for us. I'm just going to place my finger in that area. I could quite easily feel its contraction as it's raising the upper lip. So it really works in conjunction or with the previous muscle, levator labi superioris aliqui nasi. And it's going to be really hard for you to be able to discern exactly which muscle is doing the movement since they kind of work together in this action. So this muscle is innervated by the facial nerve.